That was the appalling and dirty sight presently seen at the National Museum King Square Ring Road, Benin City. Especially noticeable is the once beautiful scenery created by the water fountain, now a lying stagnant body of water clogged with plenty debris and empty plastic bottles of water. Before now, the fountain used to be a recreational center during festive period. The fountain that was constructed during the past administration of Comrade Adams Eric Oshamale was a site to build to tourists from within and outside the city. Some residents in Benin City who were at the National Museum spoke with the news crew about what they think should be done and way forward for the National Museum and bringing it to the hair days, saying the present administration have not really paid attention to giving a first lift to the museum ahead of holiday season. They advised that government should try to rejuvenate the National Museum, especially the water fountain, as it will help regenerate revenue, beautify the city and attract tourists. Normally, if you look at other countries and they have something like this, based on those ancient stuff, and they have something like this, that maybe during this festive period, families do go to visit, have fun, take pictures, places like that. But this place now, eh, me and my people, we cannot just come to someone to take pictures here. Yeah, no, no. It's, it's, not, it's not well kept. It's, so government should try their best. They should clean it up, renovate it, if possible, change the tires, make everywhere look new, look neat, then make the water flow. A few years back when I, I was coming to this place now, even me with my junior one, so I, we came to do, have a lot of fun and all that. So if, if we can still do that now, I should suggest they should just do something, something about it. There is no playing ground here for the kids. And mostly kids are kids on their those states. So you don't expect them to come that day now, they will not have anywhere to play. And here it's not even presentable for them to play. They can renovate this place, do it nice for people to come. Mostly for the children to feel comfortable because normally Christmas, New Year is owned by children. Yeah, so it will look nice for them to come and do their stuff. I advise government to come and assist us and visit back because there was a time this thing was functioning and it is very good and it makes some, it attract a lot of people because when you see that such light here, people will be coming to watch and it will make a lot of crime. That is how city develop. So what I appeal is that let government help us, particularly the Honorable Governor of this state, Honorable uh, Obaseke, I should assist and help us fix this water tanking so that we who can benefit from it, other people will benefit from it. It is part of development in city. You can't pass through Ringo without stopping to view what is happening here. But the first time I entered here last week, I was not happy. I was even questioning the people I met here that this place is just like kitchen. But however the case may be, we have government. If government can put this, thing, this place in order, they can generate money, unlike before. Like this water fountain, they used to make money. People would come here and take photographs. The present status of the museum, especially that of the water fountain lately, has sparked reactions from residents who are dismayed by the now unkept site of the museum. The month of November rides to an end. Soon, the holiday season will be here in December. There is optimism that the National Museum and its attractive water fountain will be fixed because it adds to the reputation of the ancient city, boosting its tourist potentials. Best Orator reporting for BTV News.